Well, parents in the San Antonio Independent School District worry that their children are going to have less space to play and exercise over at Bonham Academy. Our Christina Coleman is live here downtown where district leaders are discussing a controversial playground plan. Christina. Well, the meeting just wrapped up in there and it was a full house. Parents say they just want to make sure their kids have enough room to play and exercise outside at the school despite new renovations. Veronica Ramirez is heavily involved in her children's education at Bonham Academy. She takes part in the edible garden program and the last thing she wants is for her kids to have even less room outdoors because of possible school renovations. Being since it's an urban school, we're tight for space anyway, so I would hope that they use their creativity, you know, to to get the kids to be able to be outside and play more. The district spent $230,000 on a historic house on Cedar Street to either move or demolish to create more space at the roughly three acre school. But now a preservation group would like to partner with the district to create a black box theater out of the house. The building is located just behind the school. Parents worry the proposal will break up the little park space that the children have to play. The black box theater is something that is important because we're looking at fine arts and drama and of course uh, literacy, all these kinds of things that are important to our children. But also, because that, that land is so tight, like I said, it's less than three acres, and if the guidelines are, that are recommended for a middle school is 20 acres, uh, it's going to be a very, very tough challenge for us to try to find that kind of space for our kids. It was discussed further tonight, but no decision was made, leaving parents wondering what's next for their kids. I definitely think they need to play space, and it needs to be a large enough unbroken space that they can play legitimate soccer games and things like that. School leaders say they need to hear much more information on this before a decision is made, like the total amount of the cost to turn the house into a black box theater. Reporting live near downtown, Christina Coleman, Fox News at 9.